Hey YouTube, this is T1 Glister Elf and T1 Stoneforge Mystic. She's going to be my good luck charm and my coach for this one. This is modern, this is Bogles versus... Uh, actually, let me show you. So unfortunately, my opponent didn't give me like a, an MTG Goldfish version of the deck. So what you're seeing here, this is Ad Nauseam. Oh, this is uh, just a combo deck. It's a classic combo deck in modern now. It's going to try to win with Angel's Grace and Ad Nauseam, and if those two go together, I'm in a bit of trouble. I am running uh, Selesnia Bogle, so I'm probably going to lose game one. I'm a slower deck, uh, and uh, this is going to be a lot of fun. Important things to note here, in addition to Lightning Storm, there's also a Laboratory Maniac, so both of those are outs. And that's why Path can't come completely out. Oh, wait, whoa, oh, oh, excuse me. Um, so let's see. My opponent actually went forward without waiting for me to keep, so, uh, but I, I will keep. Uh, we'll say keep. Okay. It's okay. It, it happens. My, we didn't uh, communicate very well, I guess. Okay, so there's a path, so if Laboratory Maniac shows up, I'm in okay shape. I don't want to draw any more lands, and I know that there's no Blood Moon, of course, so we're probably going to go... I still want to get a, a Temple Garden here because I want to be able to play two white spells on the next turn. Evangeline, this game is a lot of fun. Trust me, this game is a lot of fun. Uh, but we're going to lead off with this. Tap it. Pay the one. Thank you for being my good luck charm. You are going to help me out. Okay. Alright, so we're going to fetch... And it's a little harder to see right here, but I'll make it happen. It'll work. We'll make it happen. And go and get a temple garden. There it goes. Ta-da! This is the game I like to play. Mm-hmm. And you've actually played this game before, Evangeline. Remember? You beat me. The last time you and I played, you beat me. And Slippery Bogle. Cool. And then I'll pass the turn. All right, we're off to a decent start, Evangeline. I think we are. Uh, off to a little bit of a slow start, unfortunately, but we'll make it happen. We'll make it work. We will do it. Mm-hmm. Ooh, itchy nose. Serum visions. Okay. Yep. <laughs> I hit Q to say to my opponent, "I'm not doing anything." Also, there you are in the bottom corner. Do you yeah. see? Yep. There you are. Mm -mm. There you are in the bottom corner too. That's right. It's the two of us. Just the two of us. Okay, <laughs> I had to. <laughs> oh, if you ever get thirsty, Evangeline, I have your drink. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, sorry, gotta untap too. Okay, ooh, we're in great shape. This is a very good card. I'm going to lead off with. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna yeah. do that with my throat for a little bit. Okay. I'm going to fetch again, uh. and this time I'm just going to get the basic planes in the deck. There's a planes in here somewhere. And then we're going to hunt through it again. Hunt through my deck to find it. Oh, where? Oh, here it is. <laughs> oh, where did my planes go? Oh, where did my planes go? It's snowy on that planes. Oh, darn it. There we go. All right. It's not going to matter, but I'll lead off with a Hyena Umbra. So that's one. And then here comes number two. We might actually steal this game one, just because my opponent's hand is a little bit slow. It looks slow, at least. And then I will... Hiya! <laughs> that's a very technical term. And we can do the math on that. That's four. All right. Yep, they changed it. They changed it already. And then we'll pass the turn. All right, you're doing. We're doing great. You're being a good luck charm, Evangeline. The T one. I want to do it. Yeah. Actually, I don't know if you're necessarily making me lucky. You're making my opponent unlucky. <laughs> you're being a bad luck charm for my opponent, but a good luck charm for me. I want to oh, do it. Oh, that's not good. That's a lotus bloom. That means we better hurry. We don't have too many more turns before we have to go. All right. My opponent has basically put a clock on me. So we're going to play this. This is a Razor Verge Thicket. Why did it come to us? 
why did it come to us? Um, oh, oh, um, it's one that we already had in our hand, you see. We started with three lands in hand, and we played all three lands. And thankfully, we haven't drawn any more. So we're probably going to do the Unflinching Courage next. Plus two, plus two. I want to do it. It's actually a little bit more damage. It's one more point of damage. Oh, you would like to do it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, can you please double click right here? Oh, okay. I'm going to tell, uh, toddlers tapping for me. Toddler's tap. Okay. If you double click like that, click it twice. Oh, a little more quickly. A little more quickly, please. Like, uh, like that. There's one. All right. Can you do this one, please? Or you can click it down here instead. All right. Ready? Or would you like me to do it? I want you to do that. Okay. I'll do it. All right, there we go. Now, let's see. So, if my opponent's at 16, if I play this, I'll be put. I'll be going to seven, or I'll be doing seven damage. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That'll put them to nine, and the next turn I'll have lethal. So yeah, we'll we'll do the unflinching courage this turn. Okay. I want to do the card. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Would you click right here for combat? You can click this part. Good, thank you. You moved us to combat. Hiya. Seven. You did it! Oh, <laughs> there we go. Oh, good job, good job. We might actually win this one. We might win. I hope we do. Unless my opponent can very quickly come up with enough to, uh, to win. All right, this is end of turn, I would think. Can I please go to the... Um, library? Yes, we're gonna go to the library today. I thought you would like that. Mm hmm My little, you're gonna be a bookworm one day. That's a good thing. Okay, what, what did they do? Oh, they put a mana on here. Oh, okay, it's Dreadship. For some reason I thought that this was the temple. Nope, it's not. So that's, a. Uh, we win. No, no, not necessarily. They could have Angel's Grace. They could have Angel's Grace. But we're going to assume assume that we win this one. Alright, so... Oh, crap, I forgot to do life gain earlier. It's not a trigger, you don't actually get to miss it. It's, it's not a trigger, but yeah, I messed up. I may be a little bit distracted, so I apologize for that. Let me scoot it down more so you can see more of T1 Stoneforge Mystic eating her hair. <laughs> you look like you're eating your hair, silly. I love you very much. Oh, darn it. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna do it like this. Here we go. That cat is on number one. That one is on number two. Wait a minute. I don't have. To, I don't actually have to do this, do I? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have exactly lethal here. I don't remember there being any sources of life gain, but I think I'm supposed to leave this up. All right. Would you like to take me to combat? Uh-huh. All you have to do is click the button. Okay, there we go. Why was it not to combat? Oh, well, you I moved it so that all you had to do was click. Oh, they said game two. Okay, so we got that. We won! And now that we won that one, I think we're in an okay shape for the rest because we have some decent sideboard cards here. Uh, Gaddic Teak goes in. That's a given. Uh, where was another one I, I remember seeing for this? Uh, Stony Silence, probably. Stony Silence will deal with... Let's see. It'll deal with that Lotus Bloom, which is uh, a four of. And Pentad Prism, also, that's an activated ability. So I can probably side in Stony Silence. It'll cut them off of some amount of mana. And then Damping Sphere does make it a little trickier on the opponent, because on a turn when they'd like to go off, they have to cast Angel's Grace, Ad Nauseam, and either Laboratory Maniac or Lightning Storm. Uh, so that, that taxes They're their mana. They're going to close. They're going to close? You think so? Mm hmm. You might be right. Hey, let me see your cheek. Okay. 
I think Dromoka's coming. It's command... so little red. Oh, my cheek is red? Uh-huh. It's hard to tell in this light, but uh, see, on the screen, my face looks very bright. <laughs> very, hey, very bright. Jay, yes, Evangeline? Can you please show it to the screen? Or oh, my face? Or maybe it looks a little oh. bit of... <laughs> I'm going to let you move out of the way first. I do have to sideboard after. Oh, yeah, I do look a tiny bit. Oh, do I have a little spot right here? Yes. Oh, I wonder what that is. Hey, you got some of it. Maybe I... I would say that the first thing that comes to mind is like a razor cut, but that's been a while, because obviously it's been a while. Look at how much this is gone. All right, so I have to see, the only enchantment I can find is Phyrexian Unlife in here. And that's probably not worth keeping Dromoka's command in for the target opponent, Saxo. All right. Um, Cornet is actually maybe, this may be the first time I ever cut a Daybreak Cornet. Um, it's really fast, it's really powerful, but I don't care about the combat aspects of it. Oh. Oh, thank you. Can't get it. You can't get it off my nose? No. Oh, can you please oh get it? do I have a little white spot on my nose? Yes. Oh, that's called a pimple. That's acne. Uh, I sometimes get it right here where my nose meets my face because I, I don't know, but for some reason that little spot there doesn't let it breathe or it lets the oil build up or something. And it comes. Why is that little red thing on your cheek? I, oh, I'm actually not sure, because I, I can't see in the camera what exactly that is, but it, it makes me think I may have cut myself. I may have gotten something on it, though. All right, so the Unflinching Courage is out. The Dromokas command... I think I don't have to worry too much about the Phyrexian Unlife. I think. I think. I can, I can change my sideboard later based on how this goes. I'm going to take the Dromokas command out. Oh, silly. Um... And then, it's a little tricky here. Um, I'm actually considering taking out the coronets. Or at least some number of them. Uh, yeah, it is it is pretty fast, though. So, what else? Oh, Evangeline, please, your foot, your foot got my arm. Silly. You know what? Path to Exile. I, I know, I know, Laboratory Maniac is a card. And if I path a Laboratory Maniac, I just win. But, but, actually, no, that's not right, because they have Pact. Never mind, so Path comes out. So even if I want to path the Laboratory Maniac, they have Pact of Negation. So they're fine, actually. So Path comes out. That's, that's the one. And then we are saved for next game. Okay. And uh, they've shuffled their deck. They've gone... Oh, okay. So I'm going to draw seven as well. No one can see you now since you're down like that. Oh, here we go. Draw seven. Here we go. Ooh, I see. Land. Land. I Because I don't see a creature here, that means effectively I have to get Dryad Arbor next turn. This is a it's little... It's going to close! I hope not. And I don't see any of my sideboard cards. I see something between your eyes. Oh, do I have any room or whatever that's called on my eye? Oh, you're right, I do. Okay. Can you please feel that little red spot? This one over here? No. That one. Ah. So my opponent asked a good question. Leyline? And the answer is I could put Leyline in. I did not. Um, but I, it's, it's fine. Because they have the Laboratory Maniac, I'm a little less oh, inclined. Oh, she, you touched that little Okay. Bubble. Oh, sorry. Just a moment. I have to reveal my hand to my opponent, please. Okay. Here we go. Now, my little boo-boo over here. Can you feel of it, please, so you can no. show me where it is? I don't Oh, can you point at it? Right there. Bold. Um. Bold? Oh! Ethereal armor. Yep, that's the one to take. Okay. They pass back to me. 
That's okay. Okay, so we found a land. Can I please do it? Oh, um, you can, when it comes around, you can tap that one. Sure can. All right. Thank you, honey. It's the store is going to close any minute by now. Oh, the library? Mm -hmm. Oh, we still have two more hours, and this won't take that long. Okay, uh, I'm going to say end of turn, EOT, <laughs> EOT apostrophe. Would you like to click that? Yes. Okay, your turn. You can help out. Time for T1 Stoneforge Mystic to do her thing. Close enough. There we go. Then we pay the one. One life. And then, there that goes. You're pretty good at this. <laughs> You'll get better at it, don't worry. It takes some time. It does take some time. There you are, Dryad Arbor. It's so beautiful. It's a pretty little forest. All right. Mm-hmm. Now on to my turn. I will draw a card. Oh, <laughs> I like it when you do that. Oh, it looks like you're eating your hair. She's silly, YouTube, she's silly. She's eating her hair. All right, now, Evangeline, if you'll, if you'll give me just a moment, please, I have to make sure I don't mess this up. So I'm going to tap this for white. And we might actually lose this one. Unfortunately, we might lose this one. We might not be fast enough. Now, because of Thoughtseize, let me let me go back here. So Thoughtseize is a two of in the sideboard. I I wasn't anticipating that being a big deal. <laughs> You're eating your hair. But maybe I should have. Oh, this is on a oh. Oh, we're, uh, we're in a little bit of trouble. It looks like they're probably going to win this next turn, Evangeline. No. <gasps> oh no, we just got Gaddick Teague. We just got Gaddick Teague. We might win. Okay, let's look. Let's see. Um, they have three Pact of Negations in the main board and one in the side. They have an Echoing Truth. But if they don't Echoing Truth this Gaddick Teague, they're in a lot of trouble. And they are in a lot of trouble. I want me to win. Yes, I would very much like to win. I think we can do it. Oh, <laughs> you being sad? <laughs> I'm over here focusing. Oh, right. <laughs> Wait, let me. Let's both do it. Ready? <laughs> okay. Would you like to take me to combat? All you have to do is click the button. Good. Oh, right. Swing four. Oh, very good. All right, moment of truth. Now, the reason this is a big deal is that as long as Skadic Teague is out, they can't play ad nauseum. They can play some other stuff, lots of other stuff, but they can't play ad nauseum. Mum, 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 mum. It's maybe not, mum, mum, mum. It may not be the most tasty, the tastiest thing. May not. You're just gonna entertain everybody for us, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You are so precious. You really are. All right. Oh. <laughs> I like it when you do your silly face. Can you please do that with me? I will try. I am, I do not apologize one bit, you two. I'm sorry. I, I mean, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. Okay, I, I say I don't apologize. I immediately apologize. All right, so we're going to play a Daybreak Coronet. That's a big one. That's a very big one. Glad I did not side this one out. Okay, would you like to say that to my opponent that we're going... Ow, ow, ooh, ooh, Evangeline. Ooh, that did not feel very good. We're, that we're going to combat... Please. Okay. Would you click the button? Oh, very good. 
You sent me to combat. Okay. One and shake it because it has vigilance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, wait, what just happened? Uh, oh, so, oh, you see. Um, just a moment. Let's see. Name a card, real cards. I see, you're doing your hair thing again. <laughs> Look at my oh, mouth. I, I need to focus, Evangeline. There's some, my opponent did something different. Na they played a card that says, name a card. Reveal cards from the top of your library to reveal the name card, then put that card into your hand. Remove all other cards revealed this way from the game, and you lose one life for each of the removed cards. Interesting. Get me oh, do it, please. they didn't. They didn't give me a chance to. I was reading. Dot dot dot. <sighs> okay, let's go back up here. Echoing Truth. So they're naming Echoing Truth. It's okay now. All I right. don't want the store to close. Okay. Alright. We'll, we'll tell my opponent no response. Alright, so they did say Echoing Truth. Alright, so what they're about to do, it looks, is they're about to cast Echoing Truth at end of turn. Mm. I want you to hold me. Oh, yes. You can, I will hold you. Oh, just a moment. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now, I think that's all that I have to do for this turn. So, is there anything else I would like to do? They can echo in truth. Oh darn it. Um. Oh, sorry. Can you. You. Please. Oh. Silly. Reveal. Oh, oh, oh. You're not making it easy, silly boots. I'm trying to type with a toddler who's pushing on my hand with her legs. Okay, now I have to read this, please, honey. See, this is why I'm actually playing with a little bit of a, a disadvantage. Okay, so Echoing Truth clearly has to target Gaddock T, not just because that's the sensible choice, but also it cannot target Dryad Arbor. Um, so that's fun. Alright, so I will tell my opponent that I am... Oh, please let me, please let me play. Please. I'm passing the turn. Okay, there we go. All right. Let's return it to hand. Let's return it to hand. My opponent might actually beat me, Evangeline. Mm -hmm. No, not your opponent. Yeah, I hope my opponent doesn't beat me, but they might. We're about to find out. There's an Angel's Grace. Okay. I'm gonna make them do it. No, don't please. Don't, don't do what? I want you to make them do it. Hmm. Yeah. Well, that way, if they don't actually have the ability, then they can't win. Let's see. There's a lightning storm. Yep, so they have a lightning storm. Probably should have done Ley Line, as it turns out. They have a storm? They do. Why? Lightning storm is a card that says a bunch of stuff. All right, so they're discarding lands. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and they, they got me here. Alright, so twelve plus the three. So twelve times two, that's twenty-four, plus three, yep, that's game.
They got me. Game three. Mm hmm. No, not game three. They beat me that one, so we have to go to another game. I was hoping I could win, but they beat me. I want you to bless the red. Okay, so now, now, I think ley lines should come in. Some number of ley lines should come in. At least one for at least one daybreak coronet. You know what? We're gonna go full hate bears on them. Full hate bears. We're gonna take out all the coronets. Evangeline, you're having fun with my little uh, uh, hairband, aren't you? Yeah. Alright, so we're having 10 hate cards, which is what I should have done last time, to be honest. Should have had 10 hate cards last turn. Last time. Oh, dadgummit. Dadgummit. Uh, you're gonna break that, though, Evangeline. If you keep doing that, you are stretching it. You are going to break it. That's what happens. Oh. That's awkward. No lands. It has a ley line, but no lands. So I can't keep it. Cannot keep it. Hmm. That's not good. I want them to see me too. Oh, they do see you now. Uh-oh. Well, this one's playable, but no... Oh dear. Yep. I say scry, that effectively means keep. Keep, and then look at top cards. The top card, what's it gonna be? Um, I think I need another land, so we'll put that on the bottom. Hello? Deck? Bottom of deck. Okay. Well, this isn't good. Why is this not good? Because I have a slow hand, unfortunately. I, I, my first hand did not have a ley line in it. Hmm, it's okay. We have, we still have a chance to win. Mm-hmm, we still have a chance. Although I really need you to be my good luck charm, Evangeline. Can you please be my good luck charm? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Uh-oh, there's a lotus bloom. So I need to find a stony silence and another land. Why do you need to find another land? Because another land would let me play more spells. And that's a good thing. We really need to play as many spells as we can. Just gonna hit my opponent for three here. Mm-hmm. And then pass the turn. It's not looking good for T1 Glistener Elf. My opponent might beat me. It, in my def I mean, had I sideboarded better for game two, had I taken out the day breaks and put in the ley lines, I, that's what I should have done. I didn't because they had Laboratory Maniac, but ley line is still a really good card in the match. And also, oh, they found a land. Never mind, they found a land. Hi. Hey there. <laughs> Hi there. Hi there. Uh oh, yeah. we're missing our land still. That's not good. That's not good. Hi. Mm-hmm. Hi. Hi. Yep, Evangeline, I think we lose this game. Why? Because I think we haven't found all the things we need to find. Hi. Hi. Hi-ha. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hi, hi They have a combo in their deck that only requires... Hi. Two cards. hi hi So, even if I find another land... I still won't have enough time because they'll get to take that last counter off the Lotus Bloom and then I won't be able to stop it. So we probably lose this game. Unfortunately. Aww. Well, we'll find out. Oh, there's another land. That's a start. That's a start.
<laughs> Hi. Uh, I think they want to see you when They me. do. I'm sure they do. Oh, hi. 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 <laughs> I got you. Hi. I got you. Mm -hmm. I know. You want me to turn towards the camera. Hi. Hi. Hi, 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 hi. Hi 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 Okay, so Evangeline, I think we lose. Ready? Let's watch the screen to see if we lose. All right, so I pass back to my opponent. My opponent is going to play nothing. Oh, is putting a counter on the dread shell. Uh oh. They found a land, Angel's Grace. Hi. Look, Evangeline. Look. Look. There it is. Okay. Yep, we lose. We lose. Aww. They're about to play through their deck. Mm hmm. Revealing all the cards in their deck. Mm -hmm. Lightning Storm. Pitching one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Yep, that's all they need. That deals me 19. <laughs> Where were my sideboard cards? LOL. I had 10. <laughs> Alright. What did you sideboard? For Leyline... Hey, hi, hi to Gaddick Teague. Hi, hi. To Damping. Hi. It's a little harder when I'm typing with one hi. hand. Okay, I'm going to type with two hands. No. See, Damping Sphere to Stony Silence. <laughs> oh. Thoughtsy's on the play. Cut for push on the draw. Ooh, interesting. Uh, Echoing Truth, Two Pact, and a Pintad Prism. Okay. Okay. Outs were Dromoka's Command, Four Daybreak Cornet, Something like that. Four path. One other. What was the other card? What was the other card I took out? Hmm. I don't remember. I don't remember what my other card was. Was it a spider umber man? Oh, oh, uh, unflinching courage. That was it. That was it. Thanks for playing. Can you tell my opponent thank you? Thank you. Aw, oh, that was very nice of you. And thank you for joining me. Even though we didn't win, that was probably my fault. Okay, There's so what- There's a guy in my nose. There's a booger, there is a booger in your nose. If I had gone Leyline instead of Daybreak Cornet, because it was a four for four, any Daybreak Cornets would have been Leylines. I had a Daybreak, that's right. So I would have been able that. So had I had I not done that, I would have had two. Uh, just realized I would have won. I would have had four mana and two hate cards out. Echoing Truth can deal with Gaddick Teague or Leyline, but can't deal with both. All right, my opponent has left. So I I messed up. I cost myself the game. I I didn't do that because of Laboratory Maniac, but as it turns out, I still should have because. It may not necessarily be the case that my... Well, actually, no, they could still. They could use two of their Simeon Spirit Guides into a Pentad Prism, and they could use that to make the blue for Laboratory Maniac. Um, but in that particular case... Yeah. Oops. Oh well, oh well. 
Oh well. Oh whale. Whale-o. Whale-o. So let's see, if I had done that, so Pinhead Prism, two Simian Spirit Guides, and another Simian Spirit Guide into Laboratory, and then they Echoing Truth, and they still won, actually. They still win. Oh well. Did what I could. Could what I did. It's so silly. We win game one when we're not supposed to, and we lose the sideboard games. How does that work? <laughs> Alright. Can you say bye-bye to the camera? Bye -bye. Oh, I'm giving her a hug. Mwah. Ooh. Mwah. There we go. Bye -bye. Hug too. Oh, hug too? Oh, yeah. Let me see if I can... Oh, there we go. You, you all get a big hug. You all get a big old hug. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Mwah. Mwah.